Hi folks, this is all the fruit. I'm in the Botanic Garden of Heidelberg in Germany. And this is Raffiolepis umbellata. It's called the Japanese Hawthorn. Actually, the German name basically translated means the Japanese grape apple. So something which is called the Hawthorn, the grape and an apple cannot be really bad, right? Well, I checked the website, which gave it some edibility ratings, a very low one, but at least it's edible. But then when I checked what is edible and how it is edible, yeah, I got a bit disappointed because it seems the fruit itself is not edible, but you can make a flower out of the seeds as a famine food. However, this site says used only when everything else fails. So when all your normal grains fail, when all your normal fruit and veg fail, when all the roots and tubers and trisomes you can make into flour are being consumed, then you turn to this fruit for food. Well, I'm not that hungry, but I haven't eaten anything but fruit today, so I will turn to this fruit. So, it looks pretty small. Well, it, it's, it resembles kind of a wild avocado. Well, not closely, but a little bit. What family is this in? Rosacea. So, all those Hawthorne and Apple names are not so far-fetched. It is more closely related to Hawthorne or Apple than to avocado. Now I'm trying the flesh, basically. It tastes like an unripe fruit. However, the seed kind of looks ripe to me. It comes off the flesh easily, so I think this fruit is ripe. And what is being eaten is actually the seed. Well... Nice, well-developed seed. It was obviously pollinated. I don't know if it's ripe or not. I don't know if it's toxic when not processed. So please, folks, don't try to eat this stuff. Hmm. Bad taste. Hmm. Tastes like the typical famine food. A little bit astringent, a little bit starchy, a little bit toxic slash chemical. Well, I believe that you could use this fruit in an emergency, but not more than that. I wouldn't eat it for fun. Anyway, don't come to the Botanic Garden of Heidelberg and eat any of the fruit, as long as you don't have a permit like me and if you encounter this fruit Raffidolepis umbellata don't rely on it for sustenance because the seed is not so big and the taste of the seed is not so great I, I doubt the taste of the flower will be much better of the flower you can make from the seed so, folks, this was the Japanese Hawthorn from the Botanic Garden of Heidelberg. Stay tuned for a lot of fruit videos from the Botanic Garden of Heidelberg. Thumbs up to the great gardeners of Heidelberg for cultivating such great stuff. And don't forget to like, share, comment and subscribe.